5 News reporter Bain Froney spoke with doctors about how these long-term symptoms can impact a person in ways that can keep you safe. Bain. Paige, Joey, good morning. That's right. Those cases are on the rise once again, and health experts really want to emphasize the importance of getting vaccinated as well as keep making the community aware of those long COVID symptoms. Now, long COVID is when you have those remaining COVID symptoms, but you actually don't have the virus still in your body. COVID-19 cases on the rebound across Texas once again. I think as a medical community, you know, we're all a little discouraged. As healthcare experts grow concerned with increasing numbers, they also warn long COVID isn't something to ignore. Basically, if you are healthy before you get COVID, that's not an assurity that you're not going to have a long haul symptom after. Some of these long COVID symptoms include some minor side effects like loss of taste or smell, but some are more serious, including respiratory problems, lack of stamina, and even brain fog, which seems to last months after a patient recovers from the virus. Some of these patients do have some of these long haul symptoms are distressing to them. They affect their everyday life. And so um, they've got to adjust and sometimes seek additional care long term because of the COVID infection they had you know, months ago. Throughout Waco, Dr. Greg Newman with the Hillcrest Urgent Care says that they have seen an increase in patients coming in with long COVID. Now, some doctors are only treating those with chronic long COVID symptoms at their practices. A lot of clinics opening up across the country specifically for this, for long COVID patients, for long haulers. Tillo believes that more clinics for long COVID patients could start popping up throughout Central Texas. But for now, doctors are puzzled about what's causing symptoms and what the future holds for patients. What is there any long term effect from actually getting COVID that we're not aware of? And, and, and we don't have that information yet. For now, though, Central Texas doctors are urging the public to avoid the virus at all costs. And they say the COVID vaccine holds the key to keeping long term symptoms to a minimum. They get vaccinated. That's your best defense against not only getting COVID and having serious consequences from COVID, including hospitalization and perhaps death, but it's a good chance that it can uh, reduce the chance of you getting those long haul symptoms as well. Now there have been cases where people do end up getting COVID-19 even while they are vaccinated, but their symptoms are much milder, meaning that their long-term COVID symptoms are also diminishing as well. In Waco, Bain Froney, 25 News.